Okay, this is what a bad distributor looks like. This happens to be a 440 Chrysler. See how it doesn't snap back? So, that is not good. So you know the, at least one spring's junk in there. Let's see, that, that's supposed to snap right back. Let's see how I can do that. That is no bueno. So pulling out the thermostat here, it's obviously stuck wide open. <laughs> and there's old chunks of Healy coil and broken bolt from all the exhaust manifold stud issues I guess they were having. Well, you gotta love it when you get the one that was jammed in there crooked out, but there's still another chunk right there to my right. So they drilled it out crooked and then tapped it and put another. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that thing. Look at that hole. Ooh. We'll be putting a big shirt in that one. working on my 440 here and I noticed something. I notice how dark and hot this is and we've been getting water in number seven here. Uh, it looks like uh, when I had the engine apart as I'm going through it. So I just stuck these on here for a visual but uh, they got this plumb wrong. This line here should go um, actually into here or on the other side. So they've got that line going all the way up to the riser. You can see the heat going here. Well, there's a rubber O-ring. I'll bet this rubber O-ring is crystallized and gone. And we're getting little droplets of water in here because this thing is torched. They got the other side plumbed the same way, but surprisingly, it's not as burnt. So like I say, they got that going here. This needs to be go here to here. And let the water go through the riser, the extension, that way. Otherwise, you're gonna have water just sitting in here and it can't flow and I can see it overheating, so. We're gonna go ahead and fix this. Okay, I took this apart. You can see where it's definitely been leaking in. And somebody made their own gasket. It's supposed to be an O-ring, like this. That's the correct kit. And look at that square cut. Look how melted and burnt and everything else that is. <laughs> There's that inner ring. There you go, that's your water entry, guaranteed. All right, ready to prime up my 440. Alright, we'll pry a little more and then we'll fire it up. 